Hey everyone, coming to you with another midweek challenge as we get closer to Sunday and we are still going through the book of Psalms right now. We're going to be in the book of Psalms through the month of August. So this coming Sunday, we're going to be in Psalm 130. And before we get to Sunday, here's what I want to challenge you with. Take some time and read Psalm 120 through 134. 120 through 134. And the reason is, in the midst of Psalms, there's this grouping of Psalms called the Psalm Psalms of Ascent, is what they're labeled. And many of you will have that label at right under the, the chapter number itself. And this grouping together is believed to be a grouping of songs that were sung while the people of Israel ascended. And there's some speculation about what they were ascending to. Some believe they were singing these when they ascended up the steps to the altar to make sacrifices. Some believe they this was when they were ascending to uh, the, the temple to worship. Others believe that this was maybe when they were returning from Babylonian captivity and coming to uh, back, back into Israel as a whole. So regardless, what you're going to see in these is a focus on the redemptive promises of God. And more specifically, we see several of these attributed to David, several to Solomon, and some not attributed to anyone. But I also want you to go back to 2 Samuel and read chapter 7, where God makes a promise to David that we commonly refer to as the Davidic covenant. And it regards this idea of how God will ultimately redeem his people. So as you read those, Psalm 120 through 134 Take some time to consider who God is in the midst of his promises and also in the midst of this worship that's taking place right in the midst of the book of Psalms. So, challenge to read those this week. And don't forget, Lord willing, this coming Sunday, we will not be here at Ephraim itself, but we will be out at Faith Bible Camp for our annual church picnic. We've got baptisms, we've got lifeguards, so there'll be swimming. Really looking forward to that day. Slight chance of rain right now, but the the chance of rain seems to be at night, so we're still hoping, but we'll update you if that changes. Hope you can join us this coming Sunday. We're going to kick things off out there at Faith Bible Camp at 1030, so hope to see you there.